Hey there folks, it's Anthony here with Touchboards. And I want to show you a little bit about the Light Touch software and some of the features that you'll find with the Light Touch display. So right here I've got the 65 inch Light Touch Pro. You just got the PC built in. What I'm going to show you works with any size, whether it's the Pro or the regular, doesn't matter. Just showing you some of the Android features as well as the software features. So the Light Pen software, which you can install on both Windows and Mac computers, is this toolbar right here. That, that's it. Have a nice day. <laughs> Real easy to use. Everything's a simple icon. You want to draw, you got a pencil or a highlighter. You want to erase, there's an eraser. I mean, it doesn't get much easier than that, right? Well, I'm going to show you real quick. So this right now is showing our computer desktop, which we can draw over. I can change a color right there. Most have a little arrow next to them. It'll bring up a drop down with different options. You know, change your line thickness, change your colors, and now I can draw on the screen. Easy. I want a new page, let's say. There's a page icon. Now, I just made a new page. And it tells you over here, now it's two of two. So I can draw on there too. I want to erase, I've got an eraser. Thin, medium, thick. I've also got a squeegee, which is gonna erase the entire page in one click. Super easy. Highlighter, text options. Save, the old floppy disk, everybody knows that, right? Save. So you've got your gear for settings up here. One of the really cool features of the Light Pen software is the screen record. That's this big red icon right there. It's like a record button. So you can actually use this rectangle here to select the region on screen. So like so, I want, I want to select that area. And now I can hit record. So it's going to record everything that happens on screen. You choose your file name, where you want to save it, and everything like that. And then it's actually going to record everything you draw in there, you're going to see in that recording. So it's fantastic if you want to save something that's not just a still image. Now one of the really cool features, if you've got a webcam, and like this one here, it's not included with the light touch, but if you have one, you set it up, plug it into your computer, and you can pull it into the light pen software. You see there's the picture right there. So you can adjust your resolution and everything. You've got your settings that come up here. So you want small window, large window, different resolutions. It's all there. But you can use now the screen record to capture not only what's happening on the screen, but the video from the camera. So I'm just going to call it. I'm going to save over that one. And there you go. So I've got now myself on the screen here, I can draw. It's a pretty thin line, but you get the idea. So now that that's stopped, I can go into Windows and I can play it back just like a regular video. And there you go. So I've got now myself on the screen here. So it's actually playing back that screen capture. You see the line I drew, the video feed, which the video feed is still playing on, actually. So, but you get the idea. It's going to capture everything right on the screen. It's a great tool. It's a great way to go. All right, so in addition to all those tools we just saw, because that's the Windows and Mac software, we've got Android built into this display. Now, to access Android, go to either side and just swipe in, and you'll get this little menu coming up. Here we can change our inputs. So one of the five HDMI inputs your uh, built-in PC, RCA, VGA, they're all right there. Just tap the one you want and it'll pop up. You've got the Android home screen. We've got a free screen feature and we've got the frequently used apps here, including Whiteboard. So Whiteboard comes up as a toolbar down below and this is gonna allow you to annotate over any input. So you don't have to have the light pen software installed. If you wanna use a Chromebook, or if you've got a guest coming in to plug in their laptop, they can use this to now draw on their screen. So let's say this is a guest laptop. I select my pen tool, color, line thickness, and now I can draw on top of it. I wanna save that picture, I can save it right there. Easy. It's gonna save it to the local drive or to a USB drive, your choice. You can also open up the full whiteboard app 
in Android, which is right here. As you can see, we had some fun with it before. Uh, but you can change your background color. So you want it to be white. You want it to be kind of a green color. You know, they've got a few options for you right there. You've got a back button. So let's say you made a mistake. You just hit back. And you can start making all that stuff go away. You've got the same color choice and line thickness that we saw before. One of the really cool features, in addition to uh, inputting images, is this right here. This breaks out your screen into three sections. Each one has its own color choice. So you can have three people writing in three different colors all at the same time. Great for a classroom environment. So you want to get out of that. You can just hit home, go back here, and there you have it. You can do multiple pages in here. You can save it back to the system or to the USB drive. Super useful. So without a computer attached, we can whiteboard. We can also whiteboard over any computer that's attached. And then in addition to all that, we can get out of here and we can use Android apps. So we just go back into our Android system. So we've got a browser built in here. We can open up and browse the web. Again, no computer attached. We can also go and uh, you can install other Android apps. They give you the basics. You want to put other stuff on there, you totally can. There's no Google Play Store, so you'll have to install that yourself. Otherwise, you just sideload whatever apps you want. That's basically it. This is the Light Touch display. They got a few great options, including the Light Mic sound system, the stand with the shelf, power cord in the back, or power strip, I should say. Um, all around great system. So if you've got any questions, or you just want to get a price, give us a call here at Touchboards, 866-942-6273.